Hey guys, this is my Keisha Kempsey from out of Chester, and I'm here. People call me the Cake Boss, and this is a cake that I have done. This is an engagement cake that I have done for a couple. So this was the first engagement cake that I have done that is a Hollywood theme. So it's a pretty big cake. So I'm going to start with telling you about my cake. All of my decorations is made out of fondant. And you just want to do them um, a couple of days in advance just for them to dry. Like my plaque is made out of black fondant. So I just cut that out and let that dry on styrofoam for about four or five days or so. My stars is made out of fondant. We have some flat stars. And some bigger ones. And I let them, um, now the bigger stars that's on the wire, you want to do them a couple of days in advance so they can stay in a wire and not slot down the wire. So you want to do them a couple of days in advance and stick the wire in them. The flat ones, you want to do them probably a couple of hours before you put them onto the cake because if you don't, they will not bend to the cake and then they will start to crack. So. It's three tiers. The bottom tier is two 12 inch dirty ice and I covered it with the white wood and fondant. The middle tier is two nine inch dirty ice and I covered that with the wood and fondant. The top tier is two seven inch. I covered that with the wheel and fondant as well. And I did a black script going around all three tiers. And then I just cut out some white fondant to make it look like the movie wheel going around it. As you can see. Going all the way around. But it stopped with, you know, the red carpet. So what I did with that, guys, before you did, before I did the black trip going around all three tiers, I did the red carpet, the fondant. And that goes all to the back of the cake. See, that's the back of the cake. So it goes down the back and it goes down the front. And then you want to do your black script going around. So that was pretty much it, guys. After you do, you know, your red carpet and you do your black script to make it look like the movie wheel. And then I directed my attention onto the clapper. This is their wedding date. So guys, and it's very shiny because I just got finished steaming it as I do all of my cakes because you want it to shine and be bright and glossy and you don't want it to look dull and ashy. So this is why I say um, do your stars in advance. See this little friend here is sliding. So I don't want him to slide. So I'm gonna have to maneuver him like so. Or put him down in the cake so he doesn't move. Like so. So stay there. And you like that and you're in the middle. Like so. Step back so you can see the cake. Again, guys, this is Cake Boss Come See from Chester. You guys can find me on Facebook at JJ Sweet Tooth, or you can type in Cake Boss of Chester. I'm also on Instagram at Cake Boss of Chester. Or, guys, you can go to my website, jjsweettooth.com. You can shoot me a message there and see more of my creations. As always, guys, thanks for the love and support. Until next time.